And like we saw yesterday with State Rep Cindy Gamrat, today State Rep Todd Corser asking this committee for a censure, trying to avoid being expelled. Check it out. He was sworn in this afternoon to tell the truth. Many of his fellow state representatives question his sincerity, given his pattern of lives and that elaborate email he sent out with a fake story that he was caught with a male prostitute to cover up his affair with Gamrat. She was back today in the audience listening. She declined comment on the way out when it was over. The House investigation found that both reps misused state resources in their cover up and to further their political offices as well as misconduct the question are they fit to stay in office I've admitted publicly that I was involved in an inappropriate relationship and the attempted cover-up I look back at the events surrounding the disclosure of my relationship with representative Gamrat and I do not recognize the person that did those things I have no excuse nor can I explain the ridiculous email and the voice recordings except to say that they were the actions of a desperate person. I understand and accept any conditions placed upon my office by the House of Representatives as it relates to my request for censure. I would ask that the members of the State House accept my censure to allow this regretful chapter to close. Now I can tell you we saw a few different sides of Todd Corser in the hot seat. That was his prepared statement. He also rambled a lot in his answers to tough questions. And then we also saw a very pointed, very from the heart, human side of Todd Corser that we haven't seen before now. We're going to show you that part of his testimony next hour at 5. Live in Lansing, Jim Kurtzner, The Now Detroit. Jim, before we let you go, when can we expect a vote from the committee and then the full house? That's a very good open question. The committee is in recess right now. Both the Democrats and the Republicans are in their closed caucuses, obviously discussing this, obviously discussing are there more questions we want to ask Todd Corser. He'll be back before the committee when they reconvene. Will that be later on this afternoon? Will it be tomorrow morning? When will the committee vote? When will a full House vote? That remains to be seen. All right, I know you'll be up there following it for us, Jim. Thank you so much.